Have you heard of trickle-truthing? It's something that narcissists do only when they're caught in lies. A trickle truth is when little nuggets of truth start to trickle out only because the narcissist has their back against a wall. You know what the truth is. You're confronting them. They're trying to dart this way and that way to get out of it and you're not letting them this time. They will start to trickle little tidbits to try to get you off their back. It's never the full truth but it's a little bit more truth than you had. So let's say they cheated on you and you caught them at a steakhouse because your friend saw them there on a Wednesday night. And you call them out and you say, I know you were with another person. My friend saw you, you're caught, the jig is up, just admit it. Maybe we can work through it if you're truthful about it. And they try to tell you, well, what about everything that you've been doing and this time, you're not having it. You're not getting distracted. Nope. I know you were at that steakhouse. I know you were there Wednesday night. And then they try to deny it. No, I wasn't really there. Mm -mm. I know you were there 100% fact. At this point, they're in a corner. So what are they going to do? They're going to trickle truth you. They're going to say, yeah, I ran into that girl and she tried to get me to go on a date with her, but I said no. Or they're going to say, yeah, I was at the steakhouse for 10 minutes and she just happened to be there. Or they're gonna say, well, maybe I left my wallet there and went back Wednesday, but I can't remember. By the way, I think that you're cheating on me because you're accusing me. And then because their whole lives are lies, they will forget the information that they told you. So if you ask them the same thing a week later, and then they're like, no, I wasn't at that restaurant at all. And you tell them, uh, yes, you were. You told me that last week. Now they're going to try to just gaslight you into thinking that you heard it wrong. To escape accountability, they do this over and over and over. They trickle truth you. And so you never get more than 10 to 20% of the truth of what's actually happening. In reality, they've been having a physical affair and meeting the person at that steakhouse every Wednesday. This is just the one that you happen to catch. They will never admit the full truth. That is not in their programming to ever expose themselves that much. If you are with a trickle truther, withhold some of the information that you know. And after they trickle out nuggets, then expose the parts that you know and watch their head explode. It's quite pathetic to watch once you see what's happening and it's obvious that this person is fundamentally a liar and a manipulator. I do have a new book on Amazon, How to Communicate with Narcissists. That link is in my bio.